Corruption Eradication Commission has questioned former Energy and Mineral Resources Minister Jero Wacik. It's the first time Jero has been questioned by the KPK following his arrest. Jero was named a suspect in a graft case at the ministry, which allegedly caused state losses of 9.9 billion rupiah. He's currently detained at the Chipinang prison. The former minister faces up to 20 years in prison and a fine of up to 1 billion rupiah if he's found guilty. Jero has declined to comment. The Corruption Eradication Commission has accused Jero of involvement in graft linked to the provision of goods and services for the ministry and the misuse of operational funds. The investigation linked to the provision of goods and services at the Ministry of Energy and Mineral Resources is the result of a development in another graft case. That case has already led to the trial of the ministry Secretary General Wariono Karno. Wariono is a suspect in two separate cases, one of accepting bribes and another of misusing ministry funds. The KPK also says it's found indications of extortion by Jero Wachik while he was still Minister of Tourism and Culture. The case at the Energy and Mineral Resources Ministry is believed to have taken place in 2011 to 2013. Jero became a suspect after the KPK allegedly found an order from him to Wariono to play around with the budget for the ministry. In July 2014, the KPK questioned Jero's wife, Tris Nawati, as well as their daughter, Ayuvi Brasita, before later questioning Jero himself for six hours. At the time, he said he was questioned over suspected irregularities in the ministry's operational fund. He also said he had no clue about what was being asked of him. 